Welcome to Clever. Clever lets you turn your 3D models into interactive presentations that you can share with other people in the cloud. In this video, we're going to look at how to create a presentation from Revit. First, you're going to need the Clever for Revit plugin. You can download it by logging into your Clever account. Switch to the Revit tab and click the Get Plugin link. Once the file has downloaded, unzip it to your desktop. To install the plugin, double click on the exe file. An installation wizard will pop up. Just follow the on-screen prompts. You can uninstall the plugin in the same way. Now launch Rivet. You will see that a new Clever tab has appeared in the ribbon. From the project browser, you can see that this project already has a number of 3D views set up. These will be replicated in the Clever presentation. It's the same with floor plans and elevations. To access the Clever export settings, go to the ribbon and click Clever. The plugin options will appear. You can choose to export only the 3D views or to export the entire project. To do this, click on Complete. The first time you do this, Clever will prompt you to log into your account. Click Login to launch a browser window. Once you are logged into your account, click Authorize. The export dialog will appear. If you're on a slow internet connection, you can choose not to upload some of the 3D views by deselecting them. When you're ready, click Continue. The export process can take a couple of minutes, so we've sped it up here. Once the project has been exported, it will load in Clever. You should now see a rendered 3D view of your project. You can navigate it by holding down the left mouse button to rotate the camera view. Holding down the right mouse button pans the camera and the scroll wheel zooms in and out. You can switch between camera views by expanding the right hand menu and clicking navigation. If you click on 3D views, you will see that Clever has exported all of the 3D views from your Revit project. Just click on the names in the list to switch between them. You can also switch between views by clicking the icons in the viewport. There are separate icons for 3D views, for floor plans and for elevations. If you expand the bottom toolbar, you will see a range of display quality options. Amongst other things, these let you set the screen resolution, apply different display styles to the presentation, adjust post-production settings like gamma and exposure, assign a ready-made background, or take a screenshot of the current view. The two icons at the top of the screen let you download the presentation to your workstation and to upload it to your Clever workspace in the cloud. Uploading the presentation to the cloud lets you share it with other people. Click on the icon and select your workspace from the drop-down. You can give the presentation a name by typing in the lower field. When you're done, click Upload Model. Again, this can take a couple of minutes. Once the upload is complete, open your web browser and log into your Clever account. You should see the project that you just uploaded in your workspace. To share it with other people, click on the three dots on the right of the thumbnail and choose Share Project. To invite someone to the presentation, type their email address into the top field. Choose whether you want them to be able to edit the presentation, to comment on it, or only to view it. And when you're ready, click Add, and then Done. An email with a link to the project will now be sent to your collaborator. To view the presentation from your own workspace, Click on the thumbnail 
and then click View Project. Again, it can take a couple of minutes to load. Once the presentation loads, you will see that you have most of the same options that you did in Clever itself. If you open the right hand menu, you will see that you can create annotations. Annotations let you add notes to a project. To add one, select Create One Now and then click anywhere in the viewport. Now you can type a message for your other collaborators. As well as entering text in the top two fields, you can use the Include Current View option to attach a thumbnail screenshot. When you're done, click Save. Your annotation should now appear in the right hand menu. And that's it. You've just created and shared your first interactive presentation with Clever.